I can't believe it's only been six months that we've been apart. To me, it seems like a lifetime. And even though at night I can sometimes see the flashes from the Yankee cannons, and I hear the screams of our brave southern boys defending the land that we love, that I am fine. And that terracotta, the plantation that you love, is still safe. <laughs> But let me assure you, if those damn Yankees try attacking, I will defend, with the help of our darkies, of course, our family's eternal home. I'll never understand why that northern devil Lincoln is so gung-ho on freeing our slaves. But then again, he can't see how happy they are. How they are gaily laughing, singing, and dancing in the fields. I know that they love me, and that they will defend me and our family's eternal home to the last drop of their little darky blood. With deepest affection, your darling Beauregard. Dear Tizzy, how are you? I'm doing good. I sure does miss you. Today, Master Beauregard has done told us that if we sees anyone in blue, that we ain't supposed to beat them. Don't tell Miss Cheney this, but Blue Jean Joe is dead. Blue Jean Joe? No! supposed to know he got some of Massa's hand-me-downs. We sure felt powerful bad about the whole thing, but hey, see raw, see raw. I learned it that from Massa while we was very in joke. Well, hope all is well, and I'll be back in your arms and the field soon. Signed, Rooster John. Dear Roberta, I miss you so much. But in my sleeping hours, the vision of your alabaster skin, draped in your green taffeta dress, helps to give me the courage to go on fighting in defense of our glorious South. I know this is something that might be too brutal for your feminine ears, but things are not going for the best. I'm even planning on arming our slaves to help defend our glorious plantation. Till I'm in your loving arms once again, your darling Beauregard. Dear Tizzy, how are you? I'm doing good. I sure does miss you. Check this out. Today, Master Beauregard is done giving guns to all us slaves to help him defend the plantation. He's not very bright, is he? <laughs> and here's one for you. And here's one for you. We get bullets too! Matter of fact, he's downright stupid to be giving guns to over 50 of us slaves. The same slaves who not more than a week ago, he was beaten regularly with a whip and was being made to work 20, 18, 37 hours a day. <laughs> you know, with this gun, I could... We'll be seeing you sooner than when. <laughs> I 
sure does miss you. I hate to inform you that the white man formerly known as Master Beauregard has done had himself a bad accident. But we are looking forward to your coming by so as you can pick up any of your belongings. Especially that ugly ass green taffeta dress. <laughs>